Ayo, hey, what is poppin' crossers? In today's video, I'm gonna be going over all the brand new bugs, fish, and sea creatures in the month of December for the Southern Hemisphere, so let's get right into it. Alrighty, so this month is a brand new month, of course, and if you are an Animal Crossing New Horizons player, you know exactly what to expect, and that is a brand new set of bugs, fish, and deep sea creatures. If you are from the Northern Hemisphere and you do want an in-depth guide for all the brand new bugs, fish, and sea creatures, make sure you check out the link down below, because that's a video for that, but in today's video, I'll be covering off all the brand new bugs, fish, and sea creatures in the month of December for the Southern Hemisphere. If you do want to stay up to date with all the brand new bugs, fish, and sea creatures every single month, make sure you hit that subscribe button because I do post these monthly. So to start off, I want to talk about everything that we'll be leaving at the end of the month of December. So if you don't have any of these bugs, fish, or sea creatures, make sure you get them before the month ends. So there's only two fish leaving at the end of the month, and that is the cherry salmon and the char. These should be relatively easy to get, both of them. Then as for bugs leaving, we have the common butterfly, the yellow butterfly, the peacock butterfly, the firefly, ladybug, violin, beetle, pill bug, and the centipede all leaving at the end of the month, which are all really easy and common bugs to catch. And then finally, for the sea creatures, we only have two leaving at the end of the month, and that is the chamber knot list, as well as the firefly squid. Both of those should be relatively easy to get as well. But yeah, those are all the fish bugs and sea creatures leaving at the end of the month of December. So if you don't have any of those, make sure you get them before the month ends, because uh, those won't be around for a while. And next up, we have all the brand new fish this month. If you do want to pause the screen here, you can, because there are plenty of fish that will be coming in this brand new month of December. So if I go over this too fast for your liking, make sure you pause the screen here. So starting off, we have the giant snakehead. This one sells for 5,500 bells at the Nook's Cranny. You can find this one at the ponds around your island. This one has a large shadow size and is available from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. around your island. Next up, we have the tilapia, which will sell for 800 bells at the Nook's Cranny. This one can be found at the river around your island. This one has a medium to small uh, shadow size, and this one is available all day around your island. Next up, we have the piranha, which sells for 2,500 bells at the Nook's Cranny. This one can also be found at the river around your island. This one has a small, less shadow size, and this one is available from 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. and 9 p.m. to 4 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the arowana, which sells for 10,000 bells at the Nook's Cranny. This one can be found at the river around your island. This one has a medium to large shadow size and is available from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the dorado, which sells for 15,000 bells at the Nook's Cranny. This one can be found at the river around your island, and this one has a large shadow size and is available from 4 a.m. to 9 p.m. around your island. Next up, we have the gar, which sells for 6,000 bells at the Nook's Cranny. This one can be found at the pond around your island. This one has a huge shadow size and is available from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the Arapaima, which sells for 10,000 bells at the next cranny. This one can be found at the river around your island. The shadow size for this is huge, and this one is available from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the Saddled Bitcher, which sells for 4,000 bells at the next cranny. Shadow size for this is medium to large. This one is available from the river also around your island, and this one is available from 9 p.m. to 4 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the Ribbon Eel, which sells for 600 bells at the next cranny. You can find this one at the sea around your island, and the shadow size for this is thin. So basically what that means, if you aren't familiar with the thin shadow sizes, uh, basically compared to a normal fish, which are thick, this, these ones will be very long and lengthy and thin, I guess you could say. And this one is available from the sea all day around your island. Next up, we have the Saw Shark, which sells for 12,000 bells at the next cranny. This one can be found at the sea around your island. This one has a huge shadow size with a fin. So if you aren't familiar with the fins as well, these fins will show in the actual shadow of the fish. So you'll, you'll be able to tell if it's a shark or not, basically. And this shark is available from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the Great White Shark, which sells for 15,000 bells at the next cranny. This one can be found at the sea around your island. This one also is huge with a fin. And this one can also be found from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the whale shark, which sells for 13,000 bells at the Nook's Cranny. This one can also be found at the sea around your island, also has a huge shadow size with a fin, and this one is available all day around your island. And then finally, we have the sucker fish, which sells for 1,500 bells at the Nook's Cranny. Shadow size for this is medium with a fin, and this one also can be found at the sea around your island, and is also available all day around your island. And uh, yeah, that's it for all the brand new fish in the month of December. Some of these might be a little bit hard to get, but if you do enough fishing, you should be able to catch these in no time. And next up, we have all the brand new bugs in the month of December for the Southern Hemisphere. So there are six new bugs this month. Starting off, we have the Emperor Butterfly, which sells for 4,000 bells at the next cranny. This one can be found flying around your island and is available from 5 p.m. to 8 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the Firefly, which sells for 300 bells at the next cranny. This one can be found also flying around your island and is available from 7 p.m. to 4 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the Drone Beetle, which sells for 200 bells at the next cranny. This one can be found on the side of trees, and this one is available all day around your island. Next up, we have the Goliath Beetle, which sells for 8,000 bells at the next cranny. This one can specifically be found on the side of palm trees and is available from 5 p.m. to 8 a.m. around your island. Next up, we have the Rainbow Stag, which sells for 6,000 bells at the next cranny. This one can also be found on the side of trees, and this one is available from 7 p.m. to 8 a.m. around your island. And finally, we have the Mosquito, which sells for 130 bells at the next cranny. You can find this one flying around your island, and this one is available from 5 p.m. to 4 a.m. around your island. That's it for all the brand new bugs this month. All of these should be pretty easy to get. Maybe not the Goliath Beetle. It might take you a while before you get that one. But if uh, a little, quick little tip for that one, uh, basically what I did is I just put a bunch of palm trees on an empty beach on my island. And eventually I was checking back on it and then eventually it would spawn there. So maybe that's what you have to do if you're having a hard time catching that one. But besides that, it should just spawn naturally. That's it for all the brand new bugs this month. Moving on to all the brand new sea creatures. So there's only two new sea creatures this month. So starting off, we have the Gazami Crab, which sells for 2,200 bells at the next cranny. Shadow size for this is medium, and this one has a slow swimming speed. And this one can be found all day around your island. Next up, we have the Tiger Prawn, which sells for 3,000 bells at the next cranny. 
The shell size for this one is small and this one has a medium swimming speed and is available from 4 p.m. to 9 a.m. around your island. Both of those should be relatively easy to get if you're doing enough swimming. But yeah, that's it for other brand new bugs, fish, and sea creatures this month. I hope you enjoyed today's video, and if you did, please drop a like. If today's video did help you out, consider subscribing to the channel because I do post these monthly. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I appreciate you guys for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Peace.